I want my own victory today, even if it's a selfish one. My army has to know why I lead. I come back into the circle. I have nothing clever to say. He's stronger. I'm faster. That's all we've learned about one another. This is not like Cassius's fight. There is no pretty form. Only brutality. He bashes me with his shield. I stay close so he can't swing his axe. The shield is ruining my shoulder. Every strike shoots agony into my molar. He lunges with it again. And I jump, pull on the shield with my left hand, and launch myself over him. A knife flickers from my wrist, and I stab it at his eyes as I pass. I miss and scrape his helmet's visor, putting a little distance between us. I reach for a knife and try a familiar trick. He bats the flying blade away contemptuously with his shield. But when he lowers it to look at me, I'm in the air, landing on his shield with all my weight. The suddenness of it pulls the shield down just a hair. I slam mud into his helmet with my offhand. He's blind. One hand holds the axe, one holds the shield. Neither can wipe his visor clean. It'd be a simple matter if he could just do that. But he can't. I hit him a dozen times on his wrist till he drops his axe. Then I take the monstrous thing and hit him on the helmet with it. The armor still doesn't break. He almost knocks me unconscious with his shield. I swing the heavy axe again. And finally, Pax crumples. I fall to a knee, panting. Then, I howl. They all howl. Howls fill the lands of Minerva. Howls from my far distant army. Howls from my ten high draft killers who help make this dueling circle. Howls from the killing field. 